Got a one way ticket down a two way street. Got the wind in my hair. Hey guys. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing a video on my spring break essentials because a spring break is coming up, at least for me. I know some people are already on spring break, but um, I don't go into spring break till April 1st. So I want to share with you guys my spring break essentials because I love spring break. And this is going to range from like makeup, fashion, and music. So without any further ado, let's get started. And if you see me looking at my phone, it's because I have all this and I want to go in order. So yeah. So the first thing for my makeup thing is, or makeup category is sunscreen and I have two sunscreens because I use two sunscreens for different parts of my body so the first one is this Neutrogena Ulta Sheer Dry Touch Sunblock with SPF 55 I put this all over my body it does not smell like um, sunblock does not leave me greasy it's awesome I love it I just love Neutrogena products so that is what I use and then on my face I put this Neutrogena oil free SPF 15 lotion and this is part of like a skincare routine that I got from Neutrogena but I just use this anyways that's my sunscreen for my face in the daytime I love it but it does smell like um, sunscreen that's the only down part of this but other than that I can get you see that because I put my makeup over and it just masks the scent anyway but if you are just wearing this by itself you will smell the sunscreen but I think it's worth it so these are my two picks then I have a tinted moisturizer and BB cream and the first tinted moisturizer that I love is this NARS one and this is the Clear Radiant Tinted Moisturizer Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Sunscreen. I love this. It's my favorite. Um, there's no negative parts in this. Like you put it on, it gives you good coverage, it doesn't make me oily, it doesn't slide off, it stays all day and I love it. And the BB cream that I would recommend, I don't have it physically with me, but it is the Maybelline BB cream. I love it. Um, it's kind of like this but not as good to me um it does make me a little oily but if i would wear that like if i'm going to the beach or anything because i know it's going to slide off anyways so i would recommend the maybelline bb cream then for blushes i have two and the first one is this by benefit and it's coralista of course i love coralista people always hear about this but i just could not not talk about it in this because i love coral blushes for springtime and this is by far my favorite coral blush for springtime no bad things stay again it goes on beautiful on the skin i feel like it goes on it can match any skin tone and it's very workable like it's very buildable but you can't overpower it because once you um build it up to its potential in your skin it's gonna stay like you can put on more but it won't like look like you have like a clown face it'll just have more color to it but not too overpowering then the next one is in my blush palette by coastal sense and it's just a hot pink i love hot pink um so it would be this color does not have a name but it looks like this and i love it then the next product that i have is this bronzer and this bronzer is by laura geller and it is called blush and brighten and honey duck i love this bronzer for springtime because during the fall and winter times i kind of want a bronzer that's more matte no shimmer but during the spring and summer i do want something with shimmer so i always reach for this um it will last you a long time i've had this for like two years and it still looks pretty new then the next thing I have is an eyeshadow palette and this is a really big thing for me because I don't really wear eyeshadows but if I do wear eyeshadows I reach for this during in the springtime and it is this covergirl quad in pure romance okay, so the two colors I like most for like the daytime in the springtime are these two and they I don't have a name but they're the, these two um, I'll give you a close-up um, I just love wearing them I love wearing the white one all over my lid by itself or the light purple lilac one over my lid all by itself during the day I think it looks gorgeous it's so girly and if I am going out like in the nighttime um I do use these two and I feel like it's a perfect spring quad it's so girly and romantic I love it so really really recommend this then I have a couple lip products and the first two are from the Revlon Lip Butter line, and I have two of them. And the first one is Cream Brulee, Creme Brulee, and the next one is Strawberry Shortcake. When I wear in the springtime, I love wearing neutrals. Like I love wearing neutral nails sometimes, and I just love wearing neutral lips. And this one is just glides on perfectly. 
it looks awesome and plus that's when I'm starting to get a little tan and it complements my skin really really well and of course I love pink and this is a perfect little baby pink that I think anybody could wear and it's just for me it says springtime and it reminds me of like easter eggs like the pastel pinks that you see and the little peeps that you see in like Walgreens and Target so those are my two lip butter brand picks and then I have when I just want like a nice little tint to my lips not very overpowering I love my rosebud salve I love this thing to death um, I love to moisturize my skin during the spring and summer because that is when the sun gets really really in my skin because I spend a lot of time outside so I really rip this out no bad things to say I love this if you have not checked this out I really really highly recommend it it's still moisturizing and it goes on to a lot of different parts of your body but I've only tried it on my lips so yeah, then the next thing, like I said, I love hot pink and this is my number one pick for hot pink lips is by Boxum in Miami. It's perfect. It matches, I feel like it will match anybody's skin tone and it just makes me feel more bright and bubbly and fun when I wear it, which is what spring break is all about. So I really, really recommend this. Then for my body spray, I have been obsessed with like passion fruit. I love passion fruit tea lemonade from starbucks i love the passion fruit juice so i recently discovered this lost in fantasy scent from victoria's secret and it is smell well it smells like passion fruit brazilian orchid and musk this is amazing it smells so good it reminds me of my juice and my drink and i'm like you know what if i can smell like that it smells good i'm good so i really recommend this if you have not checked this out really really good and i feel like i think this is their part of their um collection their signature collection so yeah then my next pick for beauty is a nail polish and again I am obsessed with Selena Gomez spring break nail polish I have raved about this so many times I put it in my spring nail polish guide so I'll link that down below for you guys if you guys have not watched that yet but again hot pink I love hot pink perfect color perfect formula glides on perfectly what you see on the bottle is what you get then that I think is all for my makeup section now moving on into fashion the first thing is swimsuit and of course swimsuits are a must because people are probably going to go to the beach pool parties and stuff like that and I currently don't have a recent one but I have my old one here and it's just a halter and it looks like this and it's just pink or not pink blue and green and I feel reminds me of the pool but I am in the market for a new one so that is just my old one then I have jean shorts I love jean shorts and I think like in the springtime especially for spring break I love dressing casually so I think these are a must and the first ones I just pulled out some and this is my Hollister one I love them a little distressed and then I just have white shorts because I like wearing white shorts I think they're very crisp and clean for spring time and then next fashion thing I have are like tops and the first thing that I love to wear with my jean shorts are just like white v-necks um this one just has a little print so it's lots of dance from the spring break um, party that I went to for the pink nation and Victoria's Secret. I love it. I just feel like you put this on with jean shorts, aviators, flip flops, and you're ready to go. It's just very, very nice. And you can even put this like over like your swimsuit and you're all like ready to go. I just like the casual look for spring break. Then the next thing that I love are racer back um, tank tops. Again, very casual, very nice, very girly, and you can pair bandos, which is something else that I include in this, but that's much later on, but I just think they're very cute and girly, and another one that I love to wear is this one, and it says, I'm a Los Angeles like girl, I just think it's so cute. Then, another thing for tops is just crop tops that um, tie in the front, and this one's just a lacy one. Like I said, I love wearing neutrals too in the springtime. And then, the last top that I have to show you is just this bright pink one, again with a little knot on the bottom. Then, the next thing that I have are dresses. I just love dresses, you know, I mean, it's warm and stuff. So my two favorite dresses from my collection is just this yellow one, bright yellow one from Vict not Victoria's Secret, Forever 21. And again, it has that racer back style, would wear a uh, bandeau under this and it's just nice. It has little pockets on the side. Very, very simple. I can dress this up, dress this down. Then the next one is I love maxi dresses. Maxi dresses are my favorite. I love wearing them. They're just so easy 
and you just put them on your hair can be beachy waves put it under your over your swimsuit and you're ready to go with like sunglasses and gladiator sandals or like flip flops i just think they're so beautiful this one is by the selena gomez line and i like it because it's sheer towards the bottom which i love i love sheer things for the springtime and my sister actually got this for me and i was like yes i love you for this so i really really recommend maxi dresses then the next thing that I have to talk about is bandos. I love bandos. Um, my favorite one that I pulled from my collection is just this one uh, from Forever 21. But I do want to check out those um, Victoria's Secret lace bralettes and their bandos because I heard amazing, amazing things about them. So I'm going to check those out. Next, I have sunglasses, and I have like two categories on the sunglasses, like fun sunglasses and just regular sunglasses. And for my fun sunglasses, I have these pink cat eye ones and i just love these i think they're so cute and fun and girly to wear like in the pool or to the beach or shopping downtown or something i just think it's so cute and again it's pink then for like regular sunglasses i just have regular old good sun uh avi aviator glasses and i just think again these look so cute with jean shorts a white tank top gladiator flip-flops over your bandeau or your swimsuit just awesome then the next thing that I have is statement necklaces and the one that I've been loving, loving, loving forever and it's this little one, bib necklace, all white, got mine at Charlotte Russe but you can find them anywhere. I know like this is like a dupe of like the J Crew one they have and I only paid I believe 13 bucks for this I think but they have like a variety of colors, they have like coral, teal, a minty one but yeah I really really love those for springtime. Then the next thing is I have a uh, towel, of course you need a towel to go to the pool or to the beach. I don't have mine physically with me, but I have a tip for you guys. Um, I like to put my towel in the form of my yoga mat and I attach my yoga strap to it because it's easy. You just put it over yourself and you don't have to mix it in with like your, your tote bag. Sometimes there's not enough room for my towel at least, so I use this. Then... My last thing for like fashion favorite is a tote bag and my tote bag is really really old. I've had it since like freshman or sophomore year in high school and it's this one and it's American Eagle and it just says I love waves. It has little sunglasses in the back and I love it because you can wear it like this or it has a longer strap like this and I love it. It just fits in everything. It's really really big and I love the color orange. I just feel like it's springs or it springs it says spring so yeah then for like food favorites to like take for spring break when you're going to like the pool or the beach or going to like a picnic on the beach um are i have water and i suggest like putting like in a water bottle with like something that you can close because i usually would take my like starbucks sippy cup with like a straw but sometimes like things can get into it like sand or like wind and stuff like puts it in there so i just recommend something mine is from pink again i think it's so girly roses and yeah i love this and it's big so you can like put a lot of water in here then i have a fruit salad you can never go wrong with fruits just chop up some strawberries pineapple watermelon you're good to go and you can just munch on it with your, your hands or you can bring like a little plastic fork then i have a granola bar because granola bars are so essential they can just pop them in your bag and you're good to go then i have chips and salsa if you're going to like a picnic or something and my favorite um chips right now of the moment are these organics and this is the organic blue corn tortilla chips with black seed. these are amazing they do not taste bad at all like by themselves i can eat them like i know they're that good because my mom likes them and she does not like anything like healthy or anything so that is a big 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 thing so i really really recommend this out and i love eating them with like um salsa any type of salsa even with guacamole they're just really really yummy and then again if you are going to like picnic thing during spring break or something uh i would pack like macaroni salad that's good it's cold you don't have to refrigerate it that much you can just put it in it's really really easy just pasta then my last thing for like a dessert kind of thing for spring break is dark chocolate pretzels they are amazing i love the ones from trader joe's they're just so 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 good then i'm uh, moving on to my music playlist that i play during in springtime spring break um it's not really it's kind of like old songs new songs just like my taste 
and the first one of course is heart attack by demi lovato if you not heard it you should totally go here it is awesome then the next one i have is oath by Cher lawyers because it's just about friends and you're gonna be hanging out with your friends and it's just perfect it goes with it then i have wings by little mix it's just a fun little song to like bump belong to when you're going down in the car going to the beach or like going to the pool or playing it while you're just sunbathing then i have anything to happen i do not know the exact artist because i heard it by fifth harmony first on the x factor but i will put her name here awesome song then i have two by the victorious cast and la boys and make it america i just think they are perfect for springtime they just it's just they're just fun songs and girly songs i think any like girl would have fun with their girlfriend just hanging by the pool or like going for a dip in the ocean so those are all my favorite or my spring break essentials. I hope that this helped you out. Share with me some of your spring break essentials by leaving it in a video response below or a comment. I would love, love, love to see it. And yeah, I hope you guys all have a marvelous spring break. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to not miss out on any more videos. And with that being said, I will see you guys later. Bye guys.